I am pleased to announce that the sponsor of today's video is once again Tokyo Treat. Hey there, I'm Sonya and I just made it to Hiroshima, Japan to start my new life. I wanted to share with you how I became best friends with my Airbnb host. So, my Airbnb host, her name is Keiko, I call her Keiko-san, and she's one of the coolest people I've ever met. And she owns this beautiful traditional Japanese style Airbnb in Miharashi in Hiroshima, Japan. It's right by the train station, Mihara station, as it says on, on the listing, two, three minute walk. And now I'll give you a little tour. Here is the Genkan, or the entryway where you take off your shoes. And then here is the hallway to the bathroom. And it is amazing. Here's the sink. There's me. The bathtub is so deep, like, I wasn't eating because of nerves and stuff, so like, like the pressure like sucked my stomach in, it was so deep. Um, I don't know why I didn't film upstairs, but if you ever come here, definitely check it out. I did go up there once, and yeah, <laughs> it was great. So here's the kitchen slash dining room. She has tea for you to use freely and she lets you use the kitchen of course and she cooks in the kitchen as well and has fed me multiple times since I've been here and I even help her cook sometimes here's the garden or there's a teapot but here's the garden so pretty I spent a lot of time out here uh, during quarantine get some vitamin D and if you'll follow me down this hallway to the right is the not that door the next door will be the bathroom down that hallway is where keiko lives and she also has a uh, another business of massaging and stuff which is cool here's the bathroom it's very cutely decorated and of course the bathroom slippers do you want to put on and uh, yes, very cute. And it's got the bidet and the seat warmer, all that stuff. One of my favorite parts of living in Japan is the toilets, but it's probably everyone's favorite part. Let's be honest. Okay. Hello. And here is my room, one of the rooms that Keiko-san rents out. Very big and beautiful and traditional Japanese style. The bed was so, so comfortable. If this Airbnb doesn't seem like heaven already, there is an adorable cat who will come into your room named Mimi. He is very chunky. He reminds me of Garfield. I'm interrupting this program to tell you about our sponsor, Tokyo Treat. Tokyo Treat is a monthly Japanese subscription box that is shipped straight from Japan and full of popular Japanese candy and snacks. They've sponsored me before and I'm so happy they're sponsoring me again because they're amazing. Like the actual best Japanese snacks subscription box. What was that? This is a booklet that explains what's in the box and where it's from. Each box has its own theme. This box is themed as uh, Shibuya, which is a city in Tokyo. Yeah, look at that. I love taiyaki. This is taiyaki. Tai is a fish and yaki means it's a fry. So puku puku Thai lemonade. Seems interesting. I'm in Japan right now and getting these boxes helps me figure out what kind of snacks I like. So when I go to the grocery store, there's just too much to choose from, so I figure out what I like. Gouda Camembert Mozzarella Cheddar, the thingies. And Kit Kats, you know Japan, the Kit Kat. 
Uh, each Tokyo treat box also comes with a fun drink. This is very interesting. It's caramel popcorn flavored soda. That's fun. Okay, like, look at all this fun stuff in here. It's also the heaviest Japanese uh, snack box on the planet, apparently. Ah! This is a good way to enjoy Japanese culture if you're not lucky enough to be in Japan like me. Uh, here is a tie-up. Let's... Mm. Mm. Crunchy, lemony, creamy. Use my code to get uh, uh, some sort of deal. This deal on the screen you can get. Use me code, use me code. Thank you for sponsoring me again, Tokyo Treat. Keiko-san was kind enough to drive me an hour to Hiroshima Airport to get my COVID test done to shorten my quarantine period from two weeks to three days. And on the way back, we stopped at some sakura viewing spots. Keiko-san is not only a 10 out of 10 host, but a 10 out of 10 friend. I didn't expect to become best friends with my Airbnb host, but we did and I still text her and she's helped me with so many other things that you will find out about pretty soon. You will be shocked and amazed. And yeah, she's like a host mom, like when I studied abroad in high school. And she even made this video of us, mostly me, but <laughs> she made this video and sent it to me, which was very sweet. So I know Keiko-san now watches my YouTube channel, so thank you Keiko-san for everything. You're the best. I'm definitely coming back to see you soon, so thank you so much for watching, everyone. I would definitely stay tuned because the drama is about to get real on my channel. So, bye bye!